Hey everybody, I posted a video this morning that stitched a creator who purported to offer proof of Noah's flood, but who also spoke at a very high volume. And uh, that struck me initially as something being done for rhetorical effects, so I didn't think anything of the implications of posting that stitched video. Now, predictably, the overwhelming majority of the comments uh, focused on the volume of that creator's voice, and some helpful commenters pointed out that that is most likely the result of a condition that that creator has. Uh, and I didn't know that such conditions existed, but I went and looked at other videos of theirs from a handful of different social media platforms, and I couldn't find a single video in which they were not speaking at a very high volume. So it does seem most likely to me that that is the case uh, for this creator. And in light of that, I grew increasingly uncomfortable with the number of comments that were coming in that were focused on the volume of their voice. And this is not to criticize uh, anyone who did comment on the volume of their voice. But uh, I took the video down. Um, I want this to be a place where we can speak truth to power and focus on the data and be analytical, but also where we can be respectful and compassionate. And that is not to say that uh, things can't get chippy in the comments. Uh, I don't have an issue with that, but when it comes to a condition like this, uh, I just don't want to be the facilitator of that kind of thing. So. I appreciate the conscientiousness of the people who pointed that out to me. I apologize to this creator. I'm not going to tag them because I don't want to bring more attention to their account. Uh, I apologize to those in the audience who may have felt targeted or attacked or in any way may have been affected by uh, the many comments that were posted on the video. And I apologize to those who may have posted thoughtful comments on that video that are now gone. Uh, this is on me. I will educate myself about this condition. I will work on being more conscientious about uh, behavior in videos that I stitch. And in short, I will try to do better in the future.